A little more than two weeks after a Fairview businessman drowned in an icy pond trying to rescue his dogs, we learn more about this man tonight. He was responsible for many major building projects in the region. Chelsea Swift had the opportunity to speak with his family and joins us now in the studio. Chelsea. Hi, Sean. David Shivers' children say they didn't realize how involved their dad was in the community. They say their father was humble and didn't want to be recognized for his generous acts. He treated all the employees like family and would do anything for them. That's Tim Shivers talking about his father, David Shivers, the former owner of Shivers Construction Company, but more notably, he was a loving father, a driven worker who looked out for his friends, family, and coworkers. His son John says many friends have reached out after his death. He said he, Dave gave him a coat in September and I wanted to know if he, I wanted it back. I said, well, you know, dad gave it to you, that's the way he was. He'd give you the shirt off his back or coat out of his closet. David Shivers started the construction company in 1968. His daughter says growing up she heard stories about how the company was shaping the infrastructure of the community. This business was always part of our childhood. It was a family business and so um, it's just such an integral part of us growing up. Shivers' children say he taught them valuable life lessons and the importance of learning from their mistakes. I got myself in a real bad situation and dad just he, he was very stern with me, but when we got done, he said, this is why you always got to have a plan. You got to know what you're going to do, and that was, that was him. He always had a plan. He really taught us a lot about hard work and getting up early and getting after it and really taught us how to treat people fairly. The Shivers family says their father's effort to try to rescue his dogs is an example of the kind of person he was trying to look out for the ones he loved, including his pets.